Street, and we are getting ready to come up with a plan to rehab this home. Um, and I'm just going to show you some of the changes that we're going to make. The panel's in good condition. If we go to a tankless water heater, we may have to upgrade the electrical service. It's currently 125 amp service. Um, it looks like there was an air conditioning, something here. This simply just needs to be patched. Over here, we notice this hole, um, but that's because the property has been replumbed. And now you can see that the water now goes up and over as opposed to through um, through the slab, which is nice. And so, so the pipes are not going through the slab. That's the water supply line over there. On the front, we're planning on getting rid of the garage door and redoing this whole surface um, with some something else, maybe not stucco, maybe we'll do something a little more interesting to give it a bit more um, appeal. Replace the front door with a glass door. All the yucky windows are gonna be replaced. We probably will keep the shutters, we'll take them down and clean them and paint them. Replace the doorbell. This vent has been added that passes through to the, um, what's going to be the third bedroom. Not sure about that, if we're gonna keep that or not. The soffit is gonna be removed. The cabinets have already been removed, but we're gonna remove the soffit, remove the popcorn from the ceiling, retexture the ceiling, make it go all the way here. So the kitchen we're planning to have, um, if we can, I believe we could do 42 inch uppers, and then basically a kitchen that will have an island that kind of came out like that. And so it'll have a little breakfast bar open onto the living space. This will be really nice. Of course, we'll leave the sink by the, um, by the window there. Pretty much the configuration that you see here is what we're going to keep. All the drywall has to be patched. Um, some new lighting fixtures added. We'll add some really fun lighting. The bathroom, um, the big question is if we're gonna keep the tub or if we're simply gonna replace it with a shower. This tub is no good, it cannot be, it, it's a it's fiberglass tub anyway. Um, it's really yucky. I don't think we can rehabilitate that tub. So probably re replace it or just do a shower. The question is if we keep this soffit, um, fill it in, put some cans in there, maybe. Definitely get the mirror, the vanity, the medicine cabinet. This whole thing's going to be gutted. Um, replacing a lot of doors. This bedroom, again, window here. The question is if we're going to replace this window. It's a newer window. Um, we're going to clean it up real well. I'm not sure if we want to keep it because it has those mullions in there, but all these old windows have to be replaced. Again, we're going to strip the popcorn from the ceiling. We'll do the same texture in here. Bedroom number two. This is a good size bedroom, actually. Um, and again, we have yucky windows that need to be replaced. Uh, on the floor, we're talking about the vinyl plank and it's gonna go extend all the way from everything at this level into the bathrooms, into the closets, one continuous uh, flow of that vinyl plank. These door frames need to be fixed and replaced. Um, again, doors need to be probably replaced. Damage the door frames. Then in here, this is, the, this is what we're gonna make the um, the third bedroom. So it actually has already been set up to be a bedroom. They put in a closet. We'll probably keep this configuration. Again, the ceiling has, has the drywall is gonna be taken down. Unfortunately, this garage door is relatively new, but it's gonna go. Um, and we're going to cover that up. Put a door here. And then the biggest thing, that biggest challenge we're gonna do is we're going to do the bathroom in here. And so what we're considering doing is moving this door from here to right there. So that would give access to a little suite. And this, would, this area can be all bathroom and getting rid of the water heater, putting a stackable washer dryer here, 
sink, toilet, and shower. This can be a really nice bathroom. Um, and then maybe even, haven't decided for sure, if we get rid of that door going into that bathroom, which go into the bedroom, to have a door here that goes into the master suite over there, or the guest suite, or the in-law suite, or whatever you want to call it. So that's pretty much it. The exterior needs a paint job. Um, flooring, windows, kitchen, remodel this bath, install a new bath, um, exterior to remove the garage door and frame and really make that happen. This is a very doable project. It's already gutted. It's ready to go. It's a great area. I'm Jules Roman, Yorkshire International.